one of the things about Bob is he's so humble about the things he has accomplished in the community and things he leads, but yet he seems to be at the forefront of leading and caring about the community and the people itself. And uh, you can see that with all the organizations he's involved with. And, you know, there's not a youth organization, I think, in Manatee County that ha he hasn't touched in some form or fashion to help, you know, the, um, the community, the young people, which goes on to, to help the parents. But, you know, that in doing so, he has really, he's preparing those young people for one day being leaders in this community by how he mentors and sets the example really for all of us. He did that as when I was growing up as being a leader in my church and I got to know him when I was a young boy scout and watched him uh, be a leader in my church and also in the community. And he does it in such a quiet way sometimes, in a reasonable way that um, there's not controversy involved with him, but he just shows that such, such distinguished leadership with the um, with the comments, with the input that he gives, and the advice that he's able to uh, to give to the organizations. Well, my experience with scouting in Manatee County has, for the last uh, actually since I came back and started practicing law, has been relatively limited. But uh, I grew up being very fond of scouting and respectful of what the group of uh, business people here in Manatee County did for scouting and teaching us who were members of one of the various troops here um, over the years to appreciate the outdoors, the beauty of Manatee County, uh, the Manatee River, all of the things that go with it. And our troop was, I think, the most active camping uh, troop as opposed to just uh, the technical sides of uh, memorizing scout law, et cetera, et cetera. But it was a wonderful experience, and I, as it was operated when I was more familiar with it, it's, it's a wonderful thing for young men to be a part of.